A sigh of relief from Las Vegas chapels. Elvis is staying. This comes after a group that owns his brand wanted to put a stop to all the Elvis weddings, but now there's been a new deal. He has not left the building. He's yeah. not left any of the buildings. He's all throughout the city. Victoria Saha at one of those, a chapel down in the strip with a look at how chapels will now move forward. Elvis is in the building and he's here to stay. So here's what happened. Authentic Brands Group, who owns Elvis's brand, was wanting to put a stop to this iconic Vegas wedding act, but now they're saying that they're willing to work with the chapels. It's hard to imagine getting married in Las Vegas without Elvis by your side, making your wedding even more special. He's man. So when Authentic Brands Group threatened to put a stop to all chapel weddings, which included an Elvis impersonator, many people were shook up. For me as an impersonator, uh, that would pretty much end my career. Ron Decker is best known as Elvis for the Viva Las Vegas Chapel. He has been acting as the king of rock and roll for 27 years. Every couple is calling us to think that if their wedding is going to be canceled because now Elvis isn't present anymore after 45 years. But there's good news. ABG says they are now willing to partner up with these chapels who use the Elvis brand. Hopefully we'll be able to work out something with these people and it won't be an exorbitant fee that we can't afford. We spoke with Ben Lahavi, a lawyer who represents several chapels who have been targeted by the ABG group. He says earlier today ABG told him they will allow Elvis impersonators in chapels only if they pay a fee of hundreds of dollars per chapel per year. <laughs> We're feeling elated now. This was a period of weeks of being extremely worried and concerned. There are Vegas wedding chapels that seem to live almost entirely on, on Elvis weddings, and many people were very, very frightened. Get married with me, Elvis. Thank you very much. The logistics of this agreement is still being worked out, but ABG did say it was never their intention to shut down the Elvis chapels. We do have their full statement up on our website. For now, looks like Elvis is staying in the building. Victoria Saha, live, local, now.